What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings 1010, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel these current ancestor and karmic messages for Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. <clears throat> ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages for Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Ancestors, please protect me as I get into this energy. For Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see. What are the messages? For Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right, so we got the Five of Cups and the Six of Pentacles. So I'm hearing something about a gambling addiction. Somebody could have a gambling addiction. Okay, they do. They do. Yeah, somebody could travel and stuff like that as well. Yeah, Two of Cups. Something about traveling and gambling. Somebody just could have a big addiction. Okay. Yeah. Something also, somebody could have paid for some spell work to be done. And they could be very sad because somebody is still going forward. Okay, when it comes to a connection is what I'm seeing here. So your ancestors want you to know that spell work was done on a connection that's still going to move forward and it's still going to be prosperous. Okay, that's why I'm getting here. And also someone has a very, very bad gambling addiction. Okay, or something like that. All right, and that could be causing like the downfall of a connection. Okay, is what I'm seeing here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right. So your soul is going to be receiving something back that you feel like that was lost. Yeah, possibly from the past. Okay, so your ancestors is going to help you gain something back that you feel like you lost. I'm feeling like depleted energy with you guys. Okay, like depletion. Okay, I'm hearing sirens as well. It's time to release negativity. So it's time to release some negativity, okay, in your energy here. Okay, so your ancestors are coming in to help you receive something that you lost. Okay, so they're going to be giving you ways on things that you can do to receive what it is you felt like you lost here. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Yeah, boom. Luck is on your side, earth signs. Yeah, when you shed that old skin. So for some of y'all, this is something you, you need to shed something in order to receive. Okay, so what is this that you need to shed for the earth signs? What does the earth signs need to shed? What does the earth sign? What does the earth signs need to shed? All right, let's see. What do the earth signs need to shed? What does the earth signs need to shed? Okay, Queen of Cups and Page of Wands and the Eight of Wands. I'm hearing being at everybody's beck and call all the time. Okay. For some of y'all, there could be like a mother figure in your energy okay for some of y'all whoever this mother energy is they're going to be like helping you like with a new idea so for some of y'all it's like i'm hearing it's like you're gonna start something else up and it's like somebody is gonna like come in and help you like remove something like it's like they're gonna give you like some kind of advice on what it is you need to do to remove something this is a very loving energy here. This could even be somebody you're going to get a reading from. Or this is somebody that's going to advise you. That you're going to go to for advice about something. Yeah, this person is going to help you. This, this, Whoever this person is, they can have water sign placements. Okay? Whoever this person is, they will be older than you. They will be older, for sure. Okay? And this person is going to come in and share some light here. I'm hearing something to do with cups, cups. I'm hearing something to do with drinks, bartender. 
okay? Yep, some of do with a fire sign too, like Sagittarius or like Cancer energy, okay? This person gonna give you some advice, I feel. I really feel that strong. Yep, and you gonna know exactly who this is. Like when this person come in, you're gonna know their energy. You're gonna know that they're a loving energy. You're not gonna question whoever this is. You're not gonna question this person at all, I feel. Nope. Even if you usually do question people, you're not going to question this person. Because it's like they're going to give you a, some kind of energy to let you know, like, they're not bullshitting you. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah. That's what I'm seeing here. So you're going to get some advice on what it is you need to share from a loving energy. I feel like whoever this person is, this person is going to be is going to be like an open vessel from your ancestor so like one of your ancestors is going to use this person's vessel to like help you shed something you and your loved ones are safe as well okay if you needed to know that okay so let's get into what is the t for the earth signs for some of y'all this even may happen when you go to an event you may meet somebody is what I'm seeing. You're going to go to an event. And this person, it's like you're going to start up a conversation and start talking to this person. And it's like, it's just going to go from there. And this person is going to help you shed some like old skin. It does not, I'm not talking about romantic. This is just somebody that's going to come in and help you shed something that you need to shed. Okay, so let me dig in a little bit deeper and see what this is here. Yeah, some kind of betrayal. Yeah. Ten of Swords. What is this shed no skin? Give me a little bit more on this shed no skin. I'm telling you, a of Wands, Two of Pentacles. Whoever this person is, they're going to shine. It's like they're going to put a spark up under your ass. That's what I'm feeling. Whoever this person is, they're going to put a spark up under you, yo. I'm telling you, that's why I feel like you're not going to regret it. You're not going to second guess it at all yo for some of y'all this could have something to do with a passionate new beginning with work this person gonna shed some kind of light on something yeah i'm telling you judgment you're gonna be like i'm done yeah you're gonna be very confident queen of wands in the upright you it's no doubt if this is work no doubt if this is like love if you get in a reading or if this is like you're just getting some kind of advice. It's like you're going to be very confident in something. Something is going to like spark something up under you. And you're going to be like, hell yeah. Hell yeah. I know what to do now. I know what I got to shed now. You know what I'm saying? That kind of energy. All right. Strong water sign and, and fire sign placements. Yeah, because we have ain't shit just wanted to flip over. Somebody ain't shit. And you need to shed their ass. Okay, this could be physically or just like audio energy. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. All right, so we have love on the brain and fake smiles and marrying for money. Okay, so somebody could be, we got legal issues. So somebody could be in a relationship with, with one person, but they can't stop thinking about somebody else. Yeah, somebody only wanting to marry for money here, and somebody could know that. Okay, so let's get into that. Let's see. Somebody could also be getting a divorce from somebody, and they can't stop thinking about you. All right, so let's get into this. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or flip the energy. Yeah, King of Swords. What else? Page of Wands. Lovers. Okay, so somebody could be very cold to somebody at this time. They're very cold to somebody. They're very, yeah, Five of Wands. And we have Tower. Four of Wands and Four of Swords. Somebody could be very cold to somebody that they could be in a connection with. It's a lot of fighting and shit going on. Okay? Because there could have been a tower. 
there could have been a tower that happened with somebody that that's causing all this 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 fiction or whatever yeah somebody could have tried to manipulate somebody and the manipulation didn't work so somebody could have got mad and started doing a lot of conflict shit what's this uh tower what's this tower yeah the moon exactly black magic yeah somebody off balance as fuck okay so this could be somebody that did some kind of like black magic and they was trying to hide it but this person's off balance like a motherfucker okay so somebody tried to do some manipulation when it came to marrying for money and now they're off balance they money fucked up somebody see straight through their ass but whoever this person is they could be trying to fake smile like everything good but it's like this person could be having a lot of conflict with somebody because it's like somebody realized that <laughs> they want to marry them for money yeah exactly sun card or somebody is only with them for money yep so it's a lot of like shit going on with this okay it's it's a lot of shit going on a lot of arguing a lot of fight and a lot of petty shit going on behind the scenes with this situation yep somebody also could be fake flexing as well okay that's going through this so we got leo sagittarius okay libra gemini aquarius virgo taurus capricorn aquarius yep Sagittarius. Crazy, huh? Yeah, somebody fake smiling like a motherfucker, like everything cool. Everything is not cool. Yeah, somebody could be lazy as hell. I'm just hearing somebody like to argue and fight. Argue, fight, and just sit on their ass. Like somebody don't do shit. That's all they do. Run their fucking mouth, and that's it. This person don't do shit. Work for nothing, do nothing. Wanna do nothing. <laughs> okay. That's it. And somebody could have seen the truth of somebody. And it's like they're not fucking with somebody. They somebody already see what somebody is on. Yeah, we got leggings. Yeah, somebody already know what somebody on, yo. Yeah, somebody already know what somebody on. Same sex lover. All right. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or that's your confirmation about what's going on with this person. Okay. We have K. Okay, so I'm doing a Capricorn could be very significant. We have 60s. So I'm going to do a death spell. USPS, UPS, FedEx, and our Amazon. Somebody does not have a beard. Acting single. <laughs> we have Sedan. Hacker. Also, somebody, somebody could be sad because somebody is like mechanic. Yeah, something about going on a trip. A uh, couple's a couple's trip or something. Widow a widower. We got short hair waves. Capricorn. Colored hair. I'm telling you. Backfire. Somebody about to get fucked up. Stay at home. <laughs> All right. We got high class. Accent. A incubus. Why? Colored eyes. We have drunk. So I'm going to do the Native American roots, heel lover, white socks somebody could love wearing, or you can have some on now while you're watching me. All right, we got drug addict, X, uh, short curly hair, okay, we have thin eyebrows. Mm-mm. Crazy, 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 crazy. <clears throat> Something with Lamar. 
I heard lions. Something to do with lions. I heard Yeti. Okay. Yeti. Something with lemon could be significant. Lemon. Okay. Something about a video with lemons. Okay. <laughs> I'm hearing. All right. Something about somebody going on a train. Somebody could be taking a train somewhere. Paying for a train to go somewhere. All right. Something with Kiwi or Catherine. Something to do with Colleen. I heard Kelly. Okay. Also, this could just be confirmation that somebody is still struggling with this addiction. So if you was like <clears throat> wondering if somebody was still struggling with a gambling addiction, this person is still struggling with that, even if they tried to hide it or if you haven't talked to this person in a while. Okay, this person is still struggling with that same problem. Okay, they still going through it. Okay, this person with the five of cups, this person is not in a good space with it either. Okay, so this person, if they've been going to the casino or gambling, they have not been winning lately. All right, wherever this person is, they have not. Okay. Yep. And there could be a lot of fighting and arguing because somebody do have this addiction. And it's, it's bad. I mean, this could be even a reason why a connection came to an end in the first place. Okay, somebody addiction could be like really, really bad, you know. Okay. But for others of you, there could be somebody that did a death spell on you. And this shit is backfiring. This person is all off balance. With the Knight of Pentacles, this person is like they trying to gain their balance. This person is about to lose control. That's what I'm hearing. This person don't know what the fuck to do and how to gain back control in their situation. They don't know what to turn, what to do, what to do first. They don't know what the fuck to do. They just confused. They're confused. Okay. Any other messages, Spirit? There could be a man that works in a medical field. I'm seeing something about a man that works in a medical field. Also, I'm seeing something about a hearing a uh, security guard. I heard security guard. Okay. All right. I heard Kiara. Kiara. Okay. Any other messages, Spirit? I heard X-Men or something to do with X-Factor. Okay. I heard Cynthia. Something to do with pageants. I heard pageants. Okay. Okay. I'm also hearing something about a uh, Broadway. Broadway. Okay, as well for somebody. Also, I heard something about kickboxing. Okay, or just boxing, period. Okay. All right, you guys. I really hope that these messages helped you or gave you some kind of clarity in your situation. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.